pay friends so you don't usually get to see this I wash my hair once a week but today you're seeing the full glory of my quarantine hair that has not been cut um, in over six months now so I'm gonna be cutting it at home pretty soon but that's what it looks like now when I wash it definitely the longest my hair has ever been it was not intentional so added bonus but I am here today to review salted caramel caramel shakeology it's a regional thing however you pronounce it and it's be a pretty short review because I'm not gonna go through everything about Shakeology you can find a lot of that on my blog on my channel um, it's all there it's amazing for your health um, reach out to me if you don't know why but it is something that I have been drinking every day for seven years now and pretty much once I tried it I felt a difference right away so I haven't stopped um, I love every flavor this one I think is one of my favorites uh, as of right now when I'm filming this it's sold out um, but if you're looking for this video chances are at the time that you're searching it might be in stock again and you're trying to figure out if you should buy it so just know that situation is in flux um, it sold out really fast and it was a limited run in the first place mm. so I think to me it tastes more like butterscotch so butterscotch pudding pop is what it reminds me of um, if anyone remembers those jello pudding pops <laughs> it was like my favorite thing when I was a kid and it is the vegan formula I find that to be a little thinner than the whey protein formula some people like that they think the whey is too like fluffy and goopy I like the thick creamy milkshake um, I can tell, tell the difference with the vegan um, but I still enjoy it um, by the way all of our shakes have zero soy no soy protein so it's plant protein but it's not soy protein um, it's a mix of different other forms of plant protein um, happy to send a sample can't send you a sample of this right now but I'll send you a sample of other flavors if you're interested in trying it and you can take a look at the label and everything that's in it just reach out to me anyway with the salted caramel it's not super super sweet like I thought it might be so our vanilla Shakeology especially the whey formula to me tastes really sweet and that's a good thing for some people it's too sweet so this is like I don't get like so much of the saltiness but it is like a little more on the savory side not super sweet what I do taste so one of the forms of plant protein that it has is quinoa and I really noticed it on our um, pumpkin spice to me that's like a glass of pumpkin pie in a good way <laughs> but because of the um, I mean I know quinoa is a seed it's not a grain but it kind of tastes like a grain and because of that kind of toasty taste that that kind of is reminiscent of the pie crust so I'm picking that up here as well it's almost like a graham cracker crumb kind of taste along with the caramel so yeah it's like butterscotch pudding with a graham cracker crust is what I'm picking up on I really do like it it's not like super super different from pumpkin spice but if you're not into the like nutmeg baking spice taste um, it's almost like pumpkin spice without that and of course you know it's not actually pumpkin but it's like the same flavor family this uh, I feel like the color is not super appetizing but it does look like butterscotch pudding so um, you know the other thing I'll say about it is there are a lot of superfoods in here medicinal herbs and when people expect this to just only taste like dessert that's when they're disappointed if you're expecting it to taste like a medicinal herbal health drink then it tastes a lot better than most so it does still have that kind of herbal undertone with the all-natural flavors to um, cover over oh how did I mix it up yes um I blend mine with water I do not like ice in my drinks obviously if you like ice in your drinks just get a good blender you can do ice um, I did this with water and half a banana and 
teaspoon of peanut butter. That to me is really key. Having a little fat keeps you full, keeps me full much longer. And um, kind of smooths out the taste for me. Like that medicinal herbal element that I was mentioning is a lot less noticeable with a little bit of nut butter. I have found and a lot of my customers have told me as well. So if you tried Shakeology and you didn't love the taste, try it with a spoonful of peanut butter, see if that makes a difference. Trying it with different like kinds of milk, almond milk, um, the like coconut beverage, there's different milks you could mix it with if that would help you like the taste better as well. Um, but make sure you try different mixing options before you give, an, give up on it entirely. Um, the health benefits are worth it and it can take a little while to find the recipe that you love the best. All right, as always, reach out to me if you're looking for suggestions or if you have questions and I hope this review was helpful.